Okay, we're just getting ready to head to Trout Creek Canyon. Here's the trailhead sign right there. First mile, you can actually take a wheelchair through, but it just, if you come over here, you can see it just kind of kind of winds up through there and on through the canyon. So we're gonna get heading out. All right, here we are on the way to through Trout Creek Canyon. As you can see, it's really beautiful here. Kind of flying blind with this thing, nothing to do find it, but i kind of show you here. This trout creek. And over here. There's Kathy over there. Hope, hope you can see her good. Alright, we're on our way back in Trout Creek Canyon again. I just figured I'd show you a little video here. This ain't too much after the creek actually gets started. Just keeps running down, but i kind of show you it's a beautiful day here. Here's the kind of the seam beside us, starting into these beautiful limestone cliffs. Nice trail, there's Kathy up ahead of us, we're heading on our way and it's just, it's just a beautiful, beautiful morning outside. Absolutely gorgeous out here today. There's another one on the way to Trout Creek Canyon, so I'm just going to take quite a few. As you can see there's the trail ahead of us, there's the old lady. You can see how beautiful it is here and like I said you can see uh, Beautiful setting, limestone cliffs along the way. It's just a gorgeous morning. Like I said, you can see it's just, a, just an unbelievable beautiful morning. Whoops. Oh, as I said, I thought I got some sunglasses. Just this camera's color backing in on this. This viewfinder's going out on this thing. The color just now came back in on it. All right, but we're gonna head in here. I'll walk for a second up here. So you're gonna get to get the shaky, shaky view. And then you'll be able to hear it here in a second. You'll be able to hear Trout Creek, and it's just not too far up here is where it comes out of the ground. That if you look, like I said, right there, there it is. Like I said, just it's a huge, huge creek on down from us where we parked, and right up here, it actually comes out of the ground as a tiny spring, which is very, very interesting to, to see something like that. Like I said, uh, I'm gonna get the bumpy ride here for a few because I'm walking right along with Kathy here see stuff. So. Alright, I'll turn it off and get on the way. Okay, still on the way to Trout Creek or through Trout Creek Canyon. There goes Kathy. There's the trail. I just want to show you, man. It's just uh this usually is not running through here. I mean, usually this is dry, but right now it's you know we've had a lot of rain for it or it's just a lot of water in the ground, but it's running through here. As you can see, the setting is unbelievably beautiful. For a hike, you go through these limestone canyons. And there's the trailhead over this bridge. There's the kind of the runoff area to Trout Creek. If you look on up ahead there. The trail continues. Way on up ahead there. You see more cliffs in the forest. And it's just really just incredible beauty here. It's just an unbelievable, beautiful area. I better stop and catch up because she's, she kept humping. Okay, I figured I'd take another one on the way through Trout Creek Canyon. This is the trail ahead up here. Like I said, as you can see, it's... Well, you can hear when I don't talk. It's just completely still and quiet. Here's your setting. This beautiful blue sky. You know, limestone cliffs forever up there. It's just gorgeous up here today. And then you'll see when I swivel around here behind that uh, there's the trail behind. Like I said, now the runoff is dried, so there's nothing running through here. Like I said, you can see it's just a beautiful setting, and we're gonna keep on going here. Okay, here's another video along Trout Creek Canyon. See, there's a trail ahead of us. Like I said it's peaceful and quiet. Afraid I'd show you the, another view of the limestone cliffs along the way. As you can see, you're just surrounded by them. You're on the other side too, but you can't see them for the woods. And right here is the remnants of an old road. At one time, there was a road that went through here that got washed out about 20 years ago or more now. But we're gonna keep on, keep on going. Okay, one more, one more stop to do a video here on Trout Creek Canyon. You see the trail ahead of us there. Like I said, it's still peaceful and quiet. And if you look ahead of us here, you can see the limestone cliffs you're just kind of right in the middle of them you 
look and they're right up here beside you. It's just, just gorgeous here this morning. It's, it couldn't be any more beautiful. All right, so we're gonna keep on going along here, but like I said, there's the trail ahead of us kind of shooting up on it through there. Okay, stop, take another video here and going through Trout Creek Canyon. Came to a little opening. The reason I stopped here is, uh, like I said, on this side you see the limestone cliffs and now we finally broke free of the woods and I can kind of show you the other side. There's the trail there. And if you go up this side, you can see that they basically run both sides. And up here, right up before this ridge line up here, that limestone cliff at the top there is where Hanging Valley actually pops out. But we're gonna keep on moving here. All right, here's one more on the way to Trout Creek Canyon, through Trout Creek Canyon. The reason I stopped here is, you know, you can see the limestone cliffs, but uh, you can see right in front of us, we go up a little incline, very small, right up through here. But the reason I got this one is, uh, I'll show you here, here's the trail in front of us. But right here in front of us, you got these. And I don't know how much sun glare I'm gonna get. I'll try to keep it out, but if you turn, you're right in here amongst these, which is very unique. Okay, another short little video clip along Trout Creek Canyon. Just stopping here and now we're kind of going to pass through these little limestone bluffs beside us. And uh, up here, oh, you'll see the trail right here. Right up here, under there, you'll see anchors where people repel, practice repelling off that little short uh, bluff right there. And then you'll be able to see, of course, you got the, you got the big spires here beside you big old limestone formations and then right beside you got this huge one right here just a very cool area just a beautiful morning completely clear in the 50s uh, slight trickle of breeze just perfect for hiking okay here's another piece of the trail of Trout Creek Canyon um, going through these little short limestone bluffs and then of course you got the huge cliffs way up there I'm gonna try to walk this trail in here ahead of us and and run into another section here where they got the uh, anchors and rock for the rock climbers and the, you know people that come up here and climb the rock and rappel back down all that stuff. I'll see if I can spot one while I'm walking this in. Like I said, there are times of the year where this this dry bed here is full of runoff coming down pretty swift. But we'll kind of take a look as we go along here and see if I can spot them. Like I said, I know they're here, it's just, uh, sometimes they blend in with the rock pretty good. I sure didn't see them, but I know they're there. I've spotted them before, it's just, uh, here just really tricky to spot on this rock sometimes. That's okay. We'll get them next time. <laughs> like I said, this is usually, oh, in the springtime, this is just, just roaring with runoff. And, uh, like I said, you can see there how there's a trail goes up through that. If you take that trail, and then you got this trail here ahead of us, they both kind of will come back together on the other side of all this stuff. And like I said, of course you got the beautiful cliffs there by you. Okay, I'm gonna take one more video here, going through Trout Creek Canyon. A little breeze picking up, still beautiful here. Kind of some rocks below us here. Um, kind of make our way down. I'll show you a piece of the trail here as we're going along. We just had to stop them um, for a second let somebody get around us that was heading through. Like I said, you don't see very many people here on certain days and sometimes you see quite a few but like I said it's just a nice relaxing trail kind of hike in here a little bit just dropped back into the woods very nice hike I said just a slight breeze picking up which is kind of neat because uh, besides the breeze part you can hear it kind of whipping through the canyon here okay so I would turn this off Okay, another clip come through Trout Creek Canyon. Stop here, show you another piece of the trail. You can see that just kind of 
winds on up through there. And like I said, I'll kind of give you another beautiful perspective here. Like I said, you just, just all along you have uh, these beautiful limestone cliffs all around. And I'll kind of pan you around here. I try to keep the sun glare out of it somewhat, but you can see that they run all along. And if you look behind us here, oops, the trail comes that way. It doesn't go through that. It just kind of goes from there and then cuts around that way. But we'll swivel back around here and keep moving. Okay, on this uh, Trout Creek Canyon Trail, for those that don't need much elevation, I'm going to show you pretty much the steepest elevation you get along the whole trail. Pretty much across right here on the trail and up that. That's it. The little tiny hills, that's all the elevation you get on this hike in just a few spots. And like you see here, we're not too far from the end of the three mile mark where you turn around, you kind of you go around that bend up there and then you're almost there. Like I said, the whole way, just like I showed you here a second ago, the same spire of limestone. It's just, it's just gorgeous here. Just absolutely beautiful. Okay, another piece of the trail here, Trunker Canyon. We're up the top of that little hill I was showing you earlier. Come down through here, and as you can see, you just both sides now, limestone cliffs, and I don't see if I can see the keep sun glare out. You're kind of up above the ravine a little bit, but all the way around you. Just neat, neat area. Like I said, we'll wind around and we're almost to the end of the three miles in, and just just turn around and come right back through. Okay, here's another piece of the trail, Trout Creek Canyon. See, it just kind of goes down. There I am, right there. You go on down and just kind of wind your way around there. And we're, like I said, you can see how it's opening up out of these cliffs now. Um, we're almost to the end of it. Like I said, I'll take another video, a clip or two maybe at the most, and we'll be be at the end of the, at the hike in. Then we just have to come back out of here. Okay, we're not too far from being through Trout Creek Canyon. I showed you this because right there, that bluff line, or that cliff line right there, right around that is where we'll be at the end. And you can kind of see here the trail kind of comes along here, crosses through, and just kind of runs along there. Like I said, you're, you're still right amongst all this beauty, but we're going to keep on going. We're just about there. I'm afraid to give you one, one more video coming through here. You can see the trail going ahead of me. We're almost in then Trout Creek Canyon. But the reason I showed you this is you start running along into this. I call it old man's beard, and I'm not sure what exactly they call it, but it's just dry and green. It's just it's great for starting a fire. I've used it before, but uh, you can kind of see that it starts hanging all along these trees through this little part of it. All right, we're going to get through the end of this. Okay, one more quick video here. We just go up through here on the Trout Creek Canyon, through there, and then go through that little tree line and we'll be there, but I'll get back on here in a minute with the end of it. Okay, I'll kind of walk you through the last little piece here of Trout Creek Canyon. Like I said, you come to a fence, a little wooden fence, and uh, then you're back into the road again where the actual Fig Great Road comes back in. So you can kind of see, you just kind of come through this little section of woods here, and then, Lo and behold, stop and show you. Right there, there's the road. So we're at the end of the hike, and then we'll turn around and come back out. Okay, we're at the end of Trout Creek Canyon. We just came through that gate I showed you earlier. If you keep going, I've actually went around this way. You can kind of wind around and come out on the other side of these. And the trail just kind of keeps going across this little runoff area here. When it's, you know, in the springtime, it's full of runoff. And like I said, if you Pan around this way, right here is the where the road comes out. At one time, this the canyon we just hiked through used to be part of this road. It used to be the Figure Eight Loop Road, and then it washed out in the flood. You know, about 20, 25 years or so ago, I think it was in the late 80s or sometime in the 80s. But like I said, it's just a beautiful area, and uh, we're just snacking up and getting ready to head back through. It's about three more miles, and like I said, three easy miles. But that's the basically the hike.